representatives of French teams will not wear the veil. This was a startling announcement made by the French government this week, the latest in a string of bizarre restrictions on Muslim attire. On Sunday, French sports minister declared that French athletes taking part in the upcoming 2024 Paris Olympic Games will not be allowed to wear the hijab. As expected, the announcement has caused outrage worldwide, and it comes just weeks after Education Minister Gabriel Attal declared a ban on abayas at educational institutions across the country. But while it's alarming, the targeted attack against Muslim women's clothing is not new in France. France already enforces a ban on Muslim women wearing veils or hijabs within public institutions, including government offices, schools, and universities. The purported reason behind these controversial measures is to force Muslims to fall in line with France's robust interpretation of laicite, or state-enforced secularism, which means they want to keep religious symbols out of government places. But while this should be applied to everyone, it mostly affects Muslims who wear headscarves or abayas for cultural or religious reasons. Just last week, French President Emmanuel Macron Macron came under fire after images showed him standing beside Queen Camilla and French First Lady Lady Bridget Macron, both of whom wore long evening gowns worn by Muslim women. Meanwhile, French Muslim women were being sent away from schools for showing up in similar long modest dresses. Muslims across France and the world said this was clear double standard and exposed how such policies are designed specifically to discriminate against Muslims. And now, social media users are calling for a boycott of the 2024 Paris Olympics to apply pressure on French authorities. They say that sporting events should not have the authority to prohibit religious symbols, especially if they don't interfere with the sport in any way and discriminate against people of specific religions and backgrounds.